Hello. How's it going, everyone? I hope you're all doing good. I hope you're all doing really, really good. So this video, um, I'm gonna do lots of sounds and I guess some visuals and I got I got stuff to talk about hopefully exciting stuff to talk about but yeah um, I hope you like the lighting situation orange it's orange so kind of looks like I'm like sitting by a fire or something Some cars that are kind of on the louder side, but tomorrow I have a bunch of stuff arriving to finish. Um, maybe not finish, but make a lot of progress with the soundproofing and acoustic improving of this room. I, uh, the back window back there is like almost completely soundproofed, but I didn't have the, the necessary supplies to soundproof, soundproof that one. That one. It looks like I'm not pointing at it, but it's over there. That one. channel bio and if you want to send triggers feel free to if you want to see me mess with anything that you think might sound good send it send it over please I got like a really big one too it's kind of expensive, but I think it'll be worth it. And I was also thinking if you want to send any like decorations that you want to see in the background of my videos. Absolutely do it. I'm really bad with decorating. I could use some help. Seriously, I could. 
Please, please send stuff. I don't know what to, I don't know what to put in the back. Is so much work. I really I under mess I underestimated how much work it would be. I have a lot of space to manage and keep clean. few days. I had so much to do and then and I was like, okay, I should make a video now. But Jesus, I'm I'm beat. Absolutely beat. starting to really settle in, like, or like the fact that I am no longer where I was for like my entire childhood and beginning of my adulthood, it's really starting to set in, like, I have, um, I've moved. Like, I didn't think I'd really ever miss it. But I, I do miss it. I even miss things I didn't think I would miss, but... Can't live there forever, though.
soon from this item. creative in this unfinished like in this unfinished space because it's like it's not the way I want it to be yet you know what I mean I feel like that makes it a little harder to get creative in here um, tomorrow tomorrow I'll make a lot of progress with be able to finish soundproofing this window. I'll have a rug to place down so that you don't have to hear me unsticking from this floor when I move. It's not exactly pleasant. Um, this is what the floor sounds like. Sounds alright. You hear the mic moving, which is uh, not perfect. Okay, next item I have this. It's a bottle of hydrating hand sanitizer. It's like two in one hand sanitizer and lotion. used it. I didn't even undo this thing. You know why I bought it was so I could empty it and I was hoping maybe the pump the pump would make oh sorry would make good sounds. I was hoping the pump would make good sounds. here they own louder cars they all remove their mufflers or something I'm not sure if that's what if that's even what a muffler is for if it's for muffling the sound I don't even know back of 
my house is in that direction. Like this window looks out into the backyard. And beyond the backyard there's a river, a big river, the Susquehanna River, which I think is pretty awesome. And next to the river there's a really nice walkway with like a row of big lamps, like tall lamps, and at night they illuminate the walkway. And it's really beautiful. It's like amazing. But because it's so amazing, there's always a lot of people there. my problem. it's like super harsh unless it's like very blatantly awful like a fork a fork on a plate type of type of deal you know because that's obviously really bad but literally anything else like I feel like it can sound pretty good asleep so I know a lot of you say to get past the leg falling asleep thing I should get a chair but maybe maybe the real solution is a softer floor because that would that would definitely um, help you know. This item's not super interesting, so I suppose I'll move on and I'll mess with with this thing. Definitely let me know what you thought though. This thing 
is a really old bottle of aftershave. As you can tell, it's pretty dark here. I can't really see what I'm doing. And my cat's in here. You can't see him, but his cat tower is back there. And he's chilling. And um, this is like his favorite room in the house to hang out in. Because I put his cat tower here, and there are windows here, and the windows have nice views, so I can sort of see why he likes this place. Beeswax wrap. That stuff sounds so good. And um, it's like one of the few triggers I like go out of my way to look up like ASMR beeswax wrap sounds. Like I actually look it up because it sounds so good. I think I ever look up triggers like that, and uh, yeah, I think I'll just hop on the bandwagon, do it. This stuff is foaming up. I don't know. I don't know if after she was. Not like that.
good sounds now. Weird. The other day, I tried cooking orange chicken and rice for the first time, and uh, the chicken went really well. The chicken was actually really good. Um, the rice, I somehow managed to ruin the rice absolutely. It was like, well, it's like all hard. Honestly, I couldn't tell if it was burnt or undercooked. Something was... I just knew something was wrong with it. Well, the recipe was using white rice. And I cooked with brown rice, so... I don't know if that has anything to do with it. in like grams and I don't I don't know why you do that like I don't I feel like, I feel like most noobs most cooking noobs don't have a scale you know and like so I started cooking while watching the video, I was cooking while watching it, 
And at the beginning of the video, he was using normal stuff like cups and milliliters. And then in the middle, he started saying stuff like, okay, now, uh, 40 grams of whatever. And I was like, what? Why? Why are, why are you using grams? So, that was kind of frustrating. And I had to eyeball everything. Because I didn't have a, you know, I'm not a drug dealer, so... I don't have a metric scale sitting around, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure those are the only types of people with scales sitting around. Cooks too, I guess, I guess. Maybe I should get one for cooking. stuff to do lid sounds with. I make after tomorrow, um, there will be much less background noise. I think, I think the soundproofing I do will make the cars so quiet that I think they will be not noticeable. I think there's technically no such thing as 100% soundproofing, I think, because of, uh, you know, science and stuff, physics, but you can get really damn close, and this window in the back, it took me a while to figure out how to get everything going, you know, or how to, I'm not an engineer or anything, so my initial plan for uh, how I was going to install the thing failed pretty horribly, but, and that, that sucked. It really sucked. Um, it was very frustrating, but I finally figured it out. Um, look at this. Oh. I guess I got dirty during the move. I don't know what that is. Anyways, this is a mother duck with three other ducks. using it now. 
forgot to say that I hope you're all doing really well. I think I forgot to say that. And it is a pleasure to be making a video for all of you guys. I can't wait to be back in a routine. It's just... Um, oh my god, there's been so many, like, complications and things to figure out after moving and so much stuff to buy like I spent so much money um but I had to buy a, a washing machine and a dryer for clothes and I got it delivered and installed right um, free of charge which is really nice of Home Depot to do that when it got here, I learned I ordered the wrong type of dryer. I ordered a gas dryer and I have an electric input. And that sucked. That really sucked. I was really looking forward to cleaning my clothes in my own house, but I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to go to a dry cleaner sometime this week but that's okay sorry you know, I hope those cars in the background I hope they don't bother you of annoy me but like I don't mind them but they only annoy me because it feels like they might annoy you and if they annoy you then shit that, that really sucks because I can't do anything about it so I can't go over there and tell them to shut up like uh but it, it should be mostly fixed soon Sometime today, when I'm done working, I say this is working, you know, this is me working, best job ever, in the whole world, ever, that I appreciate you guys for letting me do this as a job, um, but when I'm done, 
I'm gonna cook some chicken. And it's gonna be good and I can't wait. I really wanna cook some chicken. It's nice how how fast it is to cook chicken. It's like takes like twelve minutes. It's easy. babies back on the on her back. I don't think ducks actually do this. I don't think they carry their babies on their backs. Pretty unrealistic toy. What gives? Uh, I don't know. for now for this video mm -hmm. I hope you
you liked it. I really hope you liked it. See you soon. See you really soon. Probably, um, probably tomorrow. Take care. Good night. Take care.